Hello everyone, welcome back to some Final Fantasy VIII Remastered! Yes, we are back and we are still outside of the Shumi Village because I've been doing a couple of things off screen. I decided I would, well first of all see if I can get more Ultima spells, which I did. I'm gonna quickly go check and see if they've restocked again, although I doubt it. But we do have a... okay yeah, they're not back yet. What a shame. But we do have quite a decent stock of them now, I think over 60 with Squall. Let me just quickly check. 68 Ultima spells, baby! Oh yeah! Also, I went and fought a bunch more of those Grendel enemies in the forest just outside of Galbadia Garden. And I managed to get myself enough Dragon Fangs now for... Squall's ultimate weapon. We're gonna get the lion heart, baby. We're gonna do it right now. We've been putting it off long enough. Now I just need to decide which junk shop I want to go to. I think... I mean, we're gonna be heading back to Balam in, in the story very, very shortly, and they do have a junk shop there, but you know what? I kind of miss... I miss... I miss something. You'll soon see. We're gonna be heading over this way across the ocean, and far away, back to a very familiar place to us. If I can remember where the bastard hell it is. Ah, yes, this looks like it could be the place. Let me plonk my garden down here, and walk on in. Oh yes, I needed this. Is that cat stood on his head? What the fuck? Is that cat on his head, or is it supposed to be further back? Oh, that snare drum. That's what we wanted, boys and girls. That's why I came back to Timber. And here's the drunk shop. It's actually really easy to get to. So, squ- oh, crap. No, I haven't done enough yet. Hang on. Hang on a minute. So, in order to get the Lionheart, we have the Dragon Fangs. We have the... Uh, chef knives, I think they need, uh, adamantine, and we've got three energy crystals from our El Noyal cards. Now we need to use Ifrit's ammo refine ability, and refine two of those energy crystals into pulse ammo. And there we go, we now have the requisite items for Squall's ultimate weapon, Possibly my favorite ultimate weapon in any Final Fantasy game. Uh, Clouds comes pretty close, but we're going for the Lion Heart. Now, as you can see, attack doesn't go up that much, but it's uh, it, it's just uh, now that we have the Lion Heart, we can now use his ultimate limit break as well. There we go. We have the Lion Heart, baby. Oh, it only takes what? It only takes. Four dragon fangs. Okay, well, we've got some spare then, I guess. Uh, quickly check everyone else's. I don't think, apart from Renoa. Ooh, hang on a minute. We could get some new weapons for selfie. Strange vision. I uh, I need another adamantine for that. Okay, maybe that could be doable. Maybe I'll get that at some point. And again, Renoa's. I think we could do uh, if we have one more energy crystal, but for now, I kind of wish I could get... I'm going to have to look up what Quistis's better weapons are, because I don't remember what items you need for those. Or cells, actually. We could really use them. Anyway, so Squall is now even more powerful. His strength is 124, and uh, we could increase that significantly if we wanted to, but we don't really need to. Oh, one thing I do need to make sure I do is change his elemental attack, because his thunder attack is kind of a no-no against an upcoming fight. So instead, and wind is also a bad idea, so we'll give him water, I suppose? I don't really know if it matters. Blizzarga? Fire Arg. Ooh, Fire Arg. Yeah, we've got 59 of them. And again, I could give him more of those, but I'm being lazy. We've, we are... The thing is, we are so powerful still for this point in the game. We don't need to worry. 
Oh, I miss Timber's music so much, and at least the Galbadians are no longer around. Yeah, so your daughter loves cats, but... I don't know about that, man. I, I don't know about that, man. I don't know why I read that so weird. No matter what happens, don't panic. That's the sign of a pro. <laughs> okay, then. Gotta love the Tim Tim Timburnians. Timberonians. Timbies. Right. We are gonna continue the story. We've done a lot of side quests recently. There's still, I think there might be one or two we could still do. Uh, but there's no point, really. I'm gonna save those for later. We're gonna head back to where it all began. Balam. The island of Balam. The lovely, luscious island that is missing a garden <laughs> nowadays. But yes, as you can see, Galbadia Garden is also mobile, and it is hovering right outside. That's very menacing. So we need to head into town and see what's going on. I can only assume that they're here for a loan, since that was their objective in FH. And yes, this is where our former home was. Can I land in it? Oh, I can't. I can't just like pretend nothing happened. God damn it. Also, I wonder if you can go back in the fire cavern at this point. I'm going to quickly have a look. There's no reason to, unless you want to fight some of the enemies in there, I suppose. But I'm going to have a quick look. Is anyone at the entrance? Now, in this screen, it doesn't look like there is. But... Oh, I guess you can go back in. Huh. Okay. That's nice. Again, no reason to, but I just like knowing that I can. It makes me feel safe and uh, happy. Right, so we have Zell. Zell actually, I think, is needed for this point in the game. I'm not sure. Since it is Balam, you know, his hometown, and I think we have to chat to his dear mother. See if she's doing okay. And, um... Let me just check everyone else's elemental attack, actually, before I go in. Blizzaga, that's fine. Zell, what do you have? Fire. That's fine. Again, that's okay. Um, am I learning the correct ability? I think I did check that, so we're okay. Let's just go in. Oh, I can't wait to show off this lion heart, guys. It's going to be amazing. Boom, boom. Now, I think I mentioned this last time. This is a sequence I have very fond memories of. Not because I did it particularly well. I think this part of the game actually took me a very long time as a kid. Because it's a bit of a... Almost feels like an adventure game puzzle where you've got to do certain things in the right order and think to do things in the right order and talk to a lot of people and figure stuff out. It's it's a nice change of pace. I really, really like this part of the game. But uh, Zell, what the hell? What's going on here? Oh dear, there's a big car in the road. Hello. Hotel owner, we were forced out of town days ago. Our daughter's still at home, but there's nothing we can do. That's... that's not cool, man. With all these soldiers from Galbadia, we've got to stop and wonder whether Galbadia fell to the hands of the sorceress. I mean, it's, it, it, that's exactly what's happened. <laughs> you hit the nail on the head, buddy. Hotel owner's wife. I don't know what to do. What's happening to this town? When can we go in? If I knew this was going to happen, I would have brought my daughter with me. I hope she's alright. She's home alone. I'm sure she'll be fine. Well, hopefully. Anyway, let's chat to this gentleman. This town is under control, the sorceress idea. The town is off limits while we conduct our investigation. It will last for several days. Once we've uh, once we're through with our investigation, here you're next. So just stay in, uh, stay out, and stay put. You're not going to burn this place to the ground, are you? You better bloody not do. Right, so we can't actually go in. That's a problem. Yo, what's going on in here? In there. Whatever. Words. How do I progress? Oh, here we go. You guys, you guys look suspicious. What are you doing here? What's Galbadia doing in a town like this? What do you want? Are you residents here? Yeah, that's right. At least residents should be allowed in. It's off limits. You cannot enter or leave. Do you understand? 
<laughs> Who do you think you're talking to? Hmm. Wh what is it now? You said the town was off limits. Does that mean we can't deliver a message either? That's too bad. We have some info on a loan. Now that was pretty smart from Squall. Like, Zell was just going to punch his way in. Not the, not the most uh, refined method, but this, this will definitely stand a better chance of working. What? El Wait a minute. Tell me everything you know about her. Do you actually know who she is? Kind of, but we need to get inside to confirm something. Now, I don't know if that would fly, but... Hmm. If you found out any information at all, go talk, to the, go talk to the commander. My voice has changed a million times. She's staying at the hotel. You'll be rewarded. Nice one, Squally. We made it in, and yeah, it looks like you have to take Zell. Yep, you do. Quistis, get back in your party. Where do you think you're going? You're not getting out that easy. Alright, so yeah, it is flooded. Flooded with the blue armor of the Galbadians. Who's this? Nice hat. Are you gonna talk to me? That's very rude. Hello? Whatever's in the store is basically all we have left. Thanks to Miss Dinked, there hasn't been much of a panic, but there's not much we can do. Those Galbadian soldiers, they're just trying to torture us slowly. Everyone's basically on edge. Yeah, I can imagine it'd be a pretty tense situation. Uh, I mean, not. I can only imagine what it would be like to ha have your town occupied by an enemy force. Uh, don't need that draw point. Uh, there's the junk shop we could have used. Don't really need to. Let's chat to these guys. Hey, if you're done with your errands, go home. If I see you loitering, I'll have to take you in. The commander is suspicious of small towns like this. But how in the world are we supposed to find this girl alone if we only have her name to go on? Yeah, it's a bit of a difficult task. I think she'll turn up. She won't be able to run from Sorceress Adia. Then the world according to Adia will begin, along with our Garbadian rule. I don't like this guy. I I don't like this guy. Anyway, since we're back in Balam, let's check in on Zell's place, which I think is this house. Always forget which one it is. Yep. Oh, where is she? Uh, Zell? Where's your mum? Where's your mum? Where's she gone? Ah, she's just in the living room. Ma, you're safe. Zell, how on earth did you get into town? It's all in the brains, Ma. We just said we had some info on a loan. Piece of cake. Yeah, Zell, you, that was totally your plan. That was totally your idea. What a relief. I was worried you might have beaten up one of the guards. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. She knows her son very well. The soldiers thre have threatened that the sorcerers will burn the town to the ground should there be any disturbance. Well, gee. Well done, Squall. Sorceress Adia, is she here? That rhymed. I noticed a woman with a Galbadian army. Grey hair, patch over one eye. Oh, damn, that ain't Adia. We know who that is. Yeah, it must be Fusion. So they're here? What are they doing here, and why are they with the Galbadians? Leave it to me, I'll get rid of those jokers. Could Cypher be here too? Well, if Fujin is, you gotta bet uh, Raijin is. And if he is... Well, I mean, Cypher might be somewhere else still, but, you know. Big bad rascal. Yo, Zell, I've been practicing my special move just for a day like this. Yeah, super miracle kick. Wow, it's totally impressive. She looks impressed. Hands on hips. <laughs> hey, I told you time and again not to act wild in people's houses. You little shit. She didn't add that bit, but you know, she, you know she's thinking it. So don't worry, it's my special move, so I'll only use it if I have to. Well, I'm off to check things out. Be careful. <laughs> oh, that son of mine. That boy, I told him to stay inside. Yeah, good luck with that. Zell, if you see my son, just drag him back here, please. Will do. So, we have to find the commander, who is apparently staying at the hotel. 
Which was this way? What do you want? If it's the commander you're looking for, I have strict orders not to let anyone through. What? Information about alone? Hmm, more rumors. You know that we'll get a salary cut if we let him through without confirmation. Yeah, I know. In this army, your salary gets cut based on just how the boss is feeling. I guess it goes with the territory when you can't choose your own boss. Yo, listen, we have to top secret info. Bring the commander out here now. I don't know if that's gonna work, Zell. These guys are kind of suspicious, huh? <laughs> yeah, totally. Have some respect for the captain. The captain is currently on patrol. So. The captain will be sure to reward you. He'll also take full responsibility. Go talk to the captain. We need to find the captain. Now this is what took me forever as a kid. But again, I have very fond memories of this particular segment because I think the first time I did it... Now this is going to sound really weird. I don't know why I remember this. I think it's because I just love food. But I was playing this on my bunk bed with my little CRTV in my room. During the day, because I was off school, it might have been the summer holidays. Either that or I was off sick. I don't remember. But all I remember was I had a big tray of chips and gravy. And I was eating that while trying to figure this puzzle out. And it was the best time ever, okay? <laughs> I don't know why I remember it so much. Did you know there's a reward for information regarding a loan? Any bit of information is fine. Pretty generous, aren't they? Hmm. Zell, you sure came back at a good time. Do something about these soldiers. They walk around like they own the place. If only my hubby was still alive, he would have shown them for sure. Hmm. So, where is the captain? Now, there's, I think there's a couple of things you can do here. The solution is actually, it doesn't take long. But if you don't know what to do, like like I didn't, <laughs> I can, you can be walking around this place forever trying to figure out what the fuck you're supposed to do in what order. But yeah, I think you just got to talk to people. Obviously, she's saying the same thing. But we'll just explore. We'll have a look around. In fact, we'll go quickly check in this house. We don't need to. But I just like to check in on the folks. Since her parents are away, I'm packing her bags so that she'll be able to stay next door. Don't know what will become of Balam. I'm sure the sorceress and Galbadia don't give a rotten hoot about this here town. You would be correct, sir. You would be correct. Mommy and Daddy haven't come back. I can't take it. I can't take it anymore. Aw, poor thing. Uh, oh, and you know what? There's something we can do now. You'll remember, Zell wasn't too keen on us going in his room back in the day. But since the hotel's out of action, and we can't heal or save, guess what he's going to let us do? Can't stay at the hotel. Uh, I guess we have no choice. Let's just go to my room and rest. It's not like I'm inviting you guys, okay? It's because we have no choice. Zell is very protective of his room. So this is Zell's room. I, I love this room. It's so relaxing, apart from all the guns on the wall. <laughs> so this is, yeah. It's so clean for a guy's room. So I think depending on who you bring along with you, they'll have a different reaction to this. Quistis. I, I'm not sure if I've taken Quistis in Balan before. I don't remember anyway. Hey. Yeah, so I thought you had your T-board confiscated. Yay, I thought he did. <laughs> Once you reach my caliber, you gotta have more than one. Really, Zell? You mean you didn't think to come home and grab this one? Really? Why? Why wouldn't you do that? Oh, Quistis is laughing. What's so funny? <laughs> I just remembered something. Do you know about Zell's famous incident? Oh. What incident? Zell was running his T-board in the hallways of garden. He made a sharp turn and went straight into the women's rest. Oh my god! <laughs> that auto-scrolled? Like, I'm glad I read that in time. Wow, I don't remember ever hearing that story. 
I wonder if I've ever had Quistis here at this point. Why wouldn't I have taken her? I love Quistis. Huh. Anyway, I don't remember that. So he went into the women's rest. Wow, Zell, you big perv. Anyway, you get a save point here. There's no other reason to be here other than to rest, which I guess we'll do. Don't know how we're all fitting on Zell's bed there, but hey. And you can also use his punching bag. Yeah! I don't know why. Like, when I was a kid, I used to think that maybe if you punched it enough, something happened. I don't know. I've never managed to get anything to happen. I could use speed up and just punch the crap out of it like this. But I really don't think anything happens, so we're just going to leave. But this is a very nice room, Zell. Very, very nice indeed. Who's that? I guess that picture might be his dad? Yeah, maybe. Anyway. Wait, wait a minute, wait a minute. Hang on, hang on, hang on, hang on, hang on. Does Zell have books? Zell doesn't read books. Don't, don't be joking, game. Those are just decorations. Right, so. Back outside. And I think we'll head to the train station. Let's chat to these guys. Come on, hurry. We're going to be late for our shift. Come on, man. Let's go. The boss is going to kill us. Is he, is he sneaking in? What do you want? You shouldn't be walking out here. If you know anything, go to the hotel and report to the command. Yeah, I know, but I don't know where the captain is. We've got to find the captain. Don't buy up too much. Use them but Oh, you're looking for someone? I heard before there was someone sleeping behind one of the army vehicles. Is that what this is about? So that's your first hint. Also, we can buy stuff, but we don't need to. So we need to find one of the army vehicles. Now, we've only seen one vehicle... And that was back at the entrance, but that's not where you gotta go. But anyway, I'm gonna quickly check this train station anyway. Because I like to see the conversations. Station staff. Understood, sir. The food supply will be delivered to the hotel. Yeah, that's right. Better not try to cheat us now. Listen up. Sir. Be sure to keep your eyes open. Because walking around with your eyes closed is very dangerous. And very unnecessary. If you, has, if you have eyes, use them. Pro tip. Foreign food just doesn't cut it for me. I think about it every time I leave home. But boy, am I hungry. I feel like I can eat anything. Maybe there's some food on the train. Well, if it's a food delivery, I'm sure there is going to be food on the train. A big one? There's got to be a more efficient way to find this this girl. Just gather everyone up and time. That's it. What, you got a problem with that? Yeah, I do have a problem with that. You don't have enough rope. There's no way you could have enough rope for that. It's the army's food supply. They cut off the town's food supply, and still they make us deliver their food. That sucks. I'm hungry too, you know, and I have to deliver food? What's up with that? What's up with that? Yeah, that really is a shitty deal. Goddamn Galbadians. Anyway, the only place we haven't been is the docks, so that's where we're going to go next. Do, 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 do. Ah, army vehicles. New assistant behind the car? Yes, you can get in, but just going from the back, is there something there? Well, if the, if the captain's sleeping behind one of these things, let's have a look, shall we? Now, you have to do this in a certain spot, which is, this again, this is also why it's very easy to miss this. It's kind of a very specific point where you got to stand uh, how's it going? Is there any way I can help? Who or rather what are you? You never see this guy. I, I've always wondered what the hell it's about. Is it like a random homeless guy or is it some sort of weird creature? I don't know. Shh. Keep your voice down, man. There's only one story here, you know, alone. You get nothing by giving info to those Galbadian soldiers. If you find out anything, come to me. Those Galbadians have no intention of paying. I'll give you money for it. You have my word. Hey, you know where the captain is? We need to find him so we can see the commander. The captain, eh? If you want to know, it'll cost you. I have to eat too, you know. I got three types for you. Now, if you pay him 30,000 gil, he does actually tell you 
uh, a pretty good bit of information. But I'm pretty sure you can find this out without talking to him. So, but I was completely stuck as a kid, so I, I think I ended up paying this. But we're not going to. And the other bits of information I don't think are that good. I forget what the silver one is, but the bronze one is kind of pointless. Uh, so we're, we're going to forget it. Man, you guys are cheap. Everything has a price, you know. But we've learned that the commander, uh, the captain, is not currently sleeping behind the vehicles. So where is he? Just be grateful to Galbadia that this town hasn't gone up in a sea of flames. Sorceress Adia has the power to wipe out this town out, you know. You know? Hmm. I already told you, I do not know where the captain is. If you can't find him in a small town like this, something must be hiding him. Someone must be hiding him. What could be... What could he be doing by himself for such a long time? We were just talking about that girl alone. If she landed in this here town, would she be that careless enough to actually stay here? We know where she is. She's on a she's on a ship somewhere with a bunch of white seamen. Seeds. Seeds. There are also seamen because they're on a boat. Now. Do one of these guys. Yes! So if you talk to this guy, he says, Oh, the captain? Yeah, he was just fishing here. He caught a few and got really excited. Said he was going to eat them right away. So, somehow, we've missed the captain. He was just fishing here. And uh, all I'm going to say is, remember this dog. I've been told to use this dog to find a loan. But without her scent to go by, what can we do? Now remember that. Scent. This is the whole reason why I took so long to do this as a kid. Ugh, so annoying. All I do is just crouch all day and look for clues. Alone's possessions, some scent for the dog to go by. Again, there you go. Uh, but poor, poor old young kitty mage didn't didn't remember that. Didn't think about that. Nope. So what we gotta do? Pretty much just explore the whole town again. No, oh, we just got paid. Say again, why are you kids looking for the captain anyway? If you're gonna raid the place, do it while you're still young. What? Yeah. Any... Huh, the captain? Maybe you should check the harbour area? I just have. I hear the search dog barking over there quite often. Word has it, they use that dog to look for the captain sometimes too. Dun, dun, dun. Another super useful hint that for some reason, as a kid, I didn't really listen to. <laughs> so what you gotta do... I'm just wondering if any of these guys mentioned that the captain's gone past them. The captain's napping spot? How the hell should I know? Probably not sleeping in the streets. Yeah, we are, we're kind of already ahead of that point. So now it's a captain search instead of an alone search? Hmm. Then, again, nose. Pay attention. What was that? Where does the captain take a nap? But what that myself? Hmm. You gonna say anything else? The commander's angry again? <laughs> the commander's always angry. It's Fujin. He's freaking angry all the time, every day. Right, well, I'm not sure. Oh, I, I don't know if I've ever noticed this detail, but there's, there's steam coming from the window. I don't know if that's always there. Please let me know, but that might be a clue, actually, as to what's, what you're supposed to do next. So, we go back into Zell's house, and look, someone's been using the kitchen. Just now, a man came in and asked if we could use if he could use the kitchen. I think he cooked some fish. The whole room is filled with this strange odor. Yeah, fish doesn't smell too good, at least to me. I mean, maybe cooked fish is better, but like raw fish, no, not good. So now that we've been in there, this is the point where I got stuck. I was like, well, where's he gone? Where has the captain gone? Do these guys say anything? No. 
So now that we've been in there and we've covered ourselves in the scent of fish, we go back this way. We go back to the dog. And again, little mage, little 11 year old mage or however that old I was, didn't think to do this. You talk to the dog and oh, he ha he's got a trail, he's got a scent. You follow the dog, follow that dog. And uh, he's actually headed to the train station. In he goes. <laughs> what's what's happened to those guys? Dun dun dun! Yeah, if you couldn't guess who the captain was, y you got some issues. Like, yeah. F flower fields? What? Grant? So did they get knocked senseless by... I don't understand what happened here. So he was hiding in the train, trying to eat his fish. Soldiers fell flat on the floor after eating the fish that- Oh no! Wait, so is it poison? Is it food poisoning? What what kind of fish did he catch? Or maybe they're just- Maybe they're just that happy that they got food? I- I really don't know. This game's weird sometimes. Anyway, now we head back to the hotel. Hey you, stand back. This could be dangerous. The commander's just about to- Yow! Oh yeah. She's mad alright. Fujin, control your temper, you know? I was patrolling just like you told me. I even woke up that search dog. Sleeping on the job, you know? You fucking liar. You were kipping behind a car, then you went fishing. You maybe poisoned some dudes. <laughs> We gotta calm Fujin down, you know? Raijin! Wow! What are you guys doing here? We're here to liberate Balam, you know? I mean, uh, <laughs> we're here to liberate Balam! <laughs> Cypher told us to give you a whooping if we saw you, you know? You soldiers, help me out too- Oh, come on, dude! I thought we were friends! Really? Oh well, we gotta fight him. He's not gonna be too tough. Look at that lion heart. Oh, it's so sexy. You'll pay for this, Raijin. Now we can draw from him. He's got some spells. He absorbs thunder, so do not cast that on him. But, um, these soldiers we can take out pretty easily. Let's see how much damage we can do. Oh, actually, I, I do want to draw a uh, mug from him. So let's try and see what he's got to steal. Couldn't steal. Okay, let's scan him. See how much health he's got. Do 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 do. Looking for a loan with Fujin. Good at physical attacks. Tries to act cool around other people. He absorbs lightning. And he's got like 5,000 HP. Weak against poison? Cool. Or something, anyway. Right. Let's see if we can steal from him. Oh, two strength ups. Nice. Nice. Take that. You know what? Since we haven't really shown off Protect or Shell that much in the game, I'm going to cast Protect on Squall. Not that we need it, but I just like the spell animations in this game. They do look very good. And Shell as well. Why not? Um, let's see if we can get a critical with a Lionheart. Boom. Ah, oh, 
1500 damage. Dude. Ah, so good. Uh, what spells can I use on him? Let's use a water, just for fun. Actually, did pretty good damage. And down he goes. Ugh, you got me, you know. Da -da 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 -da. That was super easy. Gives a potion. Ah, it's probably one of the guards, actually. 12 AP. Shiva learned spirit plus 40%. Nice. Oh, yeah! The commander's gonna get it whooping, too. Oh, I don't think I'm gonna get a chance to change my... Shiva ability learning thing, but never mind. So I guess you're the commander. Pack your bags and get the hell out of Blam. Raijin defeated? That's right, baby. Now we're ciphering the sorceress. You're all going down. Calm down, Zell. Calm down. There you go. Fujin, looks like you're on your own. Are you still willing to fight? Rage. <laughs> She's not alone. Who's there? Major comeback, you know? Actually, I feel a lot better, you know? Better, eh? I feel invincible, you know? What, after getting your ass fucking whooped? Really? I thought we defeated you. Obviously not enough. Maybe he just used a revive on himself. I don't know. Or a, a, a revive. Phoenix down. Okay, now. Very important. Very, very important, guys. Draw from Fujin, Pandemona, our next GF. And uh, the reason we're not getting a trophy now is because I've already done this. I played a little bit ahead just to make sure I knew how to do this part. <laughs> it's been a while. And she has like life spells, Cura. Cura is pretty useful in this fight if you're getting low on health, but uh, we want to steal from them again because I'm pretty sure we can get some more items. Fujin really is pretty. Two more strength ups. Nice. Right, we can finish him off. I think Raijin does have an ability that he might use that can automatically get you down to 1 HP, which kind of sucks. And then uh, Fujin might finish you off when you're in that state, so it's kind of... kind of uh, scary sometimes. But I'm not, I'm not scared. What am I doing? What am I doing? I'm trying to find a spell that I'm going to use. Uh, with the water. And... Zell, go for a... Th oh, Thundark is a bad idea. Blizzara. Not too bad, not too bad. Uh, do you want to use a GF on these guys? Let's, let's, just for a change, let's use Leviathan. Uh, I'm not telling you. Zell, get mugging on Fujin, see what she has. A Mega Elixir. Wow, we stole those, like, first try, both of them? That's crazy. Uh, I'm going to draw some Cures. Zell's going to draw some life spells, which he has junctioned. Nine lives. Nice. <laughs> You're a cat, Zell. That was a lame joke. Time for a tsunami. This hotel's about to get flooded. And... <laughs> oh, gotta love these... angles. Great. Still haven't seen used the Tonberry GF, so I'm gonna have to show those off at some point. But we've just acquired Pandemona is has got to be one of the weirdest looking GFs in the game. 
One I don't even remember. I think it might be Wind Elemental, considering it's coming from Fujin, who absorbs wind. Oh, that's a point. We never scanned her. Let's see what it says. Let's scan her. Do do do. Do 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 do. Looking for a loan under Cypher's command. Uses wind magic and attacks with pinwheel. Ah, oh, doesn't actually say anything that interesting. But yes, she does absorb wind. She has a lot of spirit too. So magic ain't gonna do shit against her. Ouch, not bad, you know. Oh, he's curing himself. You little sod. Ha, huh, there you go. Oh, he's still kicking. Not for long. And down he goes. Sorry, Fujin, they got me, huh? Oh, 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 oh boy, the damage from Squall is insane. Oh, he... She used that ability. Oh, it wasn't Raijin, it was Fujin that does that. Oh. Oh. 69 damage. Cure yourself, Zell. Oh no, we beat him. Nice. Yeah, really not tough. But you do want to get that GF. This is Paramount. Oh, and we get a Combat King 002 magazine, which means, I think, that's going to be more abilities for Zell, or at least we'll be able to read about him. I don't know. 20 AP. Pandemona. You guys remember, I, you guys over in the UK remember Mona the Vampire? I always think of Mona the Vampire, because my sister used to love that show, and it had a stupidly catchy tune to it, intro song. My sister loved that cartoon. Anyway, Pandemona. Confirm. Pretty sure it's a wind elemental GF. Are you? Are the two of you taking orders from the sorceress? Negative. The sorceress has nothing to do with us, you know? We're acting on our own. Own plan? We're on Cypher's side, you know? That's up to you, but... Enough is enough. This isn't an internal garden conflict. We can't back out, you know? Negative. Cypher has a lot of followers, but we're his only friends. We're a posse, you know? Galbanian soldiers are only listening to Cypher because they fear the sorceress. Without us, Cypher wouldn't have a posse, you know? If you guys stand behind him that much, tell frickin' Cypher to stop this nonsense. Affirmative. We ain't no sellouts. We're behind Cypher all the way, you know? They are very loyal, you gotta give it to them. They, they are really Cypher's uh, best mates in the whole world. Even if he is a complete toss pocket. So, you want nothing to do with the garden now? From now on, we're not gonna hold back. Yep, I'm gonna be unleashing some limit breaks on you next time. Guess that's how it goes. That's what comrades are all about. Wait a minute. Don't want to talk anymore, you know? Kind of painful, you know? <laughs> Wimp. <laughs> oh, his poor shins must be absolutely bruised to fuck. Run! I do like those two, honestly. They're, they're so amusing. They're so weird. It's too bad. Friend or foe, it all comes down to circumstance. That's how we were raised. It's nothing special. Nothing special? Is that true? Then, what is this I'm feeling? I don't know, Squall. If you don't know what you're feeling, I don't know what you're feeling. Let's go. So, where are we gonna go next? Oh, hey, Selfie. Excuse me. What is it? Have you decided on a destination? Still thinking. Um, can we maybe go to Trabia Garden? 
it's like in the mountains, so maybe the sorceress will leave it alone. Um, I mean, we've already been there. We've seen it's completely fucked. And, uh, you know, the whole missile thing, Selfie, I know you haven't forgotten that, but still, yeah. Maybe there's some survivors. Who knows? Uh, yeah, she, she definitely wants to go see if everyone's alright. So, that's where we're going to be heading next. Anything for Selfie. Although, we're not going to go there straight away. <laughs> we're probably going to pay another visit to Shumi Village, and grab some more Ultimas, and also, we're going to actually head back into Balam. Because... There's a card I want. There is a card I need. And... Is the garden st Oh, look, yeah, Galbadia Gardens buggered off. Where's it gone? We don't know. Probably some other town to burn it to the ground. But hey, at least things are back to normal now. I'm so happy to be back here for a while. I didn't know what was I, what I was going to do. It's been crazy lately. First we see the garden flying by. The next thing you know, the Galbadians are taking over our town. What's next? Sorceresses? Monsters? Natural disasters? Jeez! Oh, you have no idea. <laughs> you have no idea. Right. Uh, oh, actually, considering I'm going to be playing cards, might be a good idea to save. Can I use Zell's room still? Or is he going to kick us out. Oh no, we can still use it. Sweet. And I can rest too. Wait a minute. Where'd the save point go? Oh, dude. We still punch the punching bag though. We can't rest in his bed either. Oh, that sucks. I guess you can just use the hotel. It's fine. Oh, I'll have to pay like a hundred gil or whatever. Oh well. I'm so chill. I mentioned I love this place. I love Blam. Also, it's weird that Final Fantasy VIII doesn't have like a little bit of music when you sleep. Like most Final Fantasies do have that. This one doesn't. At least I don't think so. We didn't hear it then. Oh crap, no. I wanted to save. I wanted to save! Ugh, I'm gonna have to pay again, aren't I? Oh no, I'm not. Ha! Huh. I can save. Yay, right, let's save. Because I do not want to lose any cards. I've learned my lesson. Sort of. I just hope that this, uh, this person plays the card soon. But we want to be playing, and it's kind of random. You want to play this guy, the hotel owner. That's a pretty catchy line. Sure. Please, blow it out your rear. <laughs> no, please don't. Blow? What? Anyway, you want to play cards with this guy. You seem to know rules and familiar to this region. Let's play a game with FH's rules and ours. No. I just want Balam's rules, please. I don't want sudden death or... Elemental's not bad, but... Sod off. I just want... Balam's rules are the best rules. They're the only rules. Come on. Stop it. Dude. I mean, I don't mind, because I can just listen to this music all day, but... Eventually, I would like to play cards with you, sir. <sighs> really? How many times, man? What the hell? Just give up. <laughs> really? There we go. That's the rules I want. Trade rule difference as well. Nice. Open. Great stuff. Right, let's play with Cypher, Renoa, Zelquistis, and Diablos. And he's not played it, you little dick. Pretty sure this is the guy. He's supposed to play, eventually, the Pandemona card. Don't know why he has it, of all people. Kinda random. 
but I guess we'll be playing it a few times, probably, until he plays it. Because I do want it very badly. Uh, shucks. I've not done this very well, actually. Uh, Renoa could take that, but then she'll get taken. So... Uh, let's be... Well, you know what, screw it, let's just take that. Ah! Interesting. Okay, Renoa, you go there. Perfect. Ba bum ba bum ba bum ba bum ba bum ba bum And booyah! Don't have to worry about same or plus or anything. God, I love Balam's rules. Right, well, I guess we'll take, uh... I don't know. I don't know. What should I take? Hexadragon? Yeah, why not? Tom Berry? Actually, don't need those. We'll grab the rest, though. Uh, I hope he plays it soon. Play your Pandemona card, mister. That would be great. Mm, oh, crap. Yeah, Diablos. There it is, right at the top, and it is Wind Elemental, so there you go. Let's see if we can grab it. Uh, let's play defensive with Diablos first. Probably going to take it, though. Yep, that's fine. That's okay. Quistis... Actually, Cypher. Oh, crap, he can take Cypher from above. Whoops. Ooh, kind of a boo-boo there. That's nah, fine, though. We got it. We got it. It's okay. It's all right. Chill. Chill out, guys. It's fine. Uh, Renoa, just be defensive for now. And we win! Oh, wait, it was a draw! What? Oh, I lost track of that. Fuck! No! I thought we were winning! <laughs> Bollocks! <laughs> oh, he's gone great at this game, guys. Aren't, aren't I just the best? He's not playing it anymore. You absolute ass bag. You son of a bitch. <laughs> uh, I'm useless. I'm a fraud and my DualShock's battery's low. No! God damn it. Uh, uh, uh. Right. What should I do? What should I do? Cypher, you go there, I guess. Oh, the Malboro, whatever. Oh, bastard. Problem is, he has pretty good cards. He has pretty good cards. So, I'm going to put Renoa there. And then... Oh, he's still got sevens on the left, though. That really, 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 really sucks. But I can take this one. It's fine. Mwahaha. <laughs> Now we win. Unfortunately, none of the cards I want. I guess I'll grab a Malboro and a, another Ruby Dragon. Play the card again, please. I fucked up last time. Please play the card. Don't make me wait. And instead of Diablos, I'm actually gonna pick Minotaur. Oh, dude! Play the card! God damn it! Do 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 Come on! I don't know why I don't use speed up. I'm probably gonna. This will be sped up anyway, but I'm also gonna use speed up, so it's gonna be extra fast. Extra, extra fast. I'm so glad it doesn't speed up the audio, because that would suck. Well, it will be sped up for you guys, but not, like, super sped up. I don't know what I'm saying. I win! Yay! Let's grab a Hexadragon again, and an Adamantois, and a Tarama, and the Turtopod, or whatever. I don't care. Probably just going to refine him anyway. <clears throat> Play the card, sir, please. 
please. Yay! Yay! Now let's win it this time. Is he playing the exact same deck as he had last time? I don't know. Maybe not. Maybe he is. At least he goes first this time. Right. Remember. Uh, I can be taken. Oh, damn it. Only Cypher wasn't weak to the seven. So let's play defensive. Kill mom. Right. Okay. That's still not great, though. Uh, Renoa, you just go there. Son of a bitch. Son of a bitch. I guess Zell. Take that. And then... Ah, we won. We won! Yay! We get the Pandemona card and a behemoth. Alright, that took a little bit longer than they anticipated, but that's okay. We have the Pandemona card, so let's have a quick check on our card collection here. It's looking pretty good. Looking pretty, pretty good. Yeah, Pandemona. Uh, and in fact, we'll check what we can refine that into, shall we? Pandemona turns into 100 windmills. Okay, that makes sense. Really not worth refining that item, unless you want like a bazillion tornado spells, but we've already got those. And yeah, that's good. All right, now we can head off to Trabia. Unless there's something else I want to do on the way, but I don't think there is. This is Snake telling you to subscribe to Mage Masher 22 on YouTube and Twitch. Snake out.